an interesting situation here, and you have to use some discernment when looking at this whole thing. We have Max Kaiser talking about what China could do here within the next six to nine months. Six to nine months, that's rather soon. And they're saying that it could crush the dollar. Now, of course, we've heard all this stuff for years about things that could bring down the economy and affect the U.S. dollar out here on the world stage. But everything that I've seen at this point shows me that these world leaders seem to be preparing for something new here on the world stage. Now, as I talked about in a special video I dropped on DLive, when it comes to ushering in a new world system, you're going to have to have the collapse of old systems, including the U.S. dollar. And there's going to have to be steps to get there. Now, there could be a lot of pain and suffering in an event like that, or there could be a semi-smooth handoff. If you go back in time and you look at when they tried to take away the tally sticks and give them fiat, the people did not want to do it, so then they turned around and said, okay, then we'll do away with all the debt that was attached to it. Then they just openly accepted it. What they're talking about now is that China is pushing a gold-backed cryptocurrency that will blindside the U.S. dollar. No, it's not Bitcoin. No, they're not behind Bitcoin, especially in my opinion. Why would this mystery Satoshi Nakamoto, which is just crap to me, why would he build his Bitcoin on a hash that the NSA created? Huh? Hmm. So that's why you're not hearing that they're pushing a gold-backed Bitcoin or anything like that. No, there's something being used with this on the world stage to prepare governments and everything for a big shift, if you can't see it. I mean, for crying out loud, all your stock markets, your CNBC has a crypto show. Uh, they now You can now invest in, in markets through Fidelity and, to, and through uh, your retirement. You can re invest into these things. Come on, people. If you can't see the writing on the wall and where this is going, I don't know what to tell you. I've been trying to tell you for a long time that this is where they're taking it. The very first video I put out was called The Beast Blockchain because I warned that if people don't rise and get their own currency and stand behind it, that this beast will. And it will track everybody, every grain of rice, every bit of food, and you and I via blockchain globally. They will. And it comes down to the same old tactic, whether it's a car, a knife, or this system. It's good or bad people. It's not the system itself. It's not the car that kills people. Not the knife. Not the weapon. It's the people utilizing it. So this is a system that could be ran good by righteous people or bad by nefarious people. And if things are not going to change, the same power structure is still in place. It doesn't matter what system they put in play. They're going to have the control and power. Do you understand this? That's what I'm trying to tell you. And a gold-backed crypto could send fiat currencies that are backed by nothing crashing all around the globe. Something is going to be the domino that pushes these things over. Either that or a lights-out situation in this country. They'll get what they want. And don't forget, if that happens and everything comes back up online years later, they'll make this one big block, the North American Union. And they'll push what? The Amero. I've warned you over and over and over, and it's right around the corner. It's just going to take the right series of events out here in these markets in one major push. And I find it interesting that Kaiser's sitting here saying within six to nine months, and don't think that they're not prepared here on the world stage. You could say, how is it so? The United States would never let that be. You better think again. They let China in the IMF basket. Rothschild has been behind China since Mao you better do your research and awaken to this game on this world stage.